All right, what's up, guys? Welcome back to another FTL Multiverse video. We're going to be jumping back in here and try to get some unlocks. It's been... Well, we unlocked a fair amount last, last run, but I want to unlock some new crazy stuff, so we're going to definitely be going for that. If you guys are liking the videos, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I just did a real-life thumbs up because you guys are the best. All right, new game. So, what I'm thinking is we've got all of these unlocked. Sylvan's, look, we'll get there. We'll get there. I'm, I'm trying to come up with a good build so that we can just go like a whole run devoted to taking out Sylvan. Forget the flagship, but that is not today. So what I think I'm going to do is obviously a lot of ships are behind like RNG unlocks. You, know, you just have to find the events and we'll keep trying our best to do that. But I want to try to just go down the line and kind of unlock the next things. So with any Rebel Cruiser. So we could do the Rebel Cruiser to unlock the Engineer. Okay, be cool. All variants of all of these. Rebel and Engineer. Civilian and Militia. I see. Well, we're pretty close to that. We just have to would have to play this. Okay. We could play... So this we just have to find out there. Defeat a flagship with the prototype Cruiser A, which is this. Oh, I see. Unidentified Cruiser. Any spider cruiser, huh? Where is the spider cruiser? I really want that thing. NG, we have not found the quest for yet. We haven't been able to unlock the separatist ship yet either. Okay. We could do this and get the Dustbringer cruiser, which I would be pretty interested in, actually. The Zoltan cruiser, I don't think would be that bad. Um, they're pretty good, generally. I would be definitely open to that and then see what the other variants look like. Okay. Maybe we'll do this. Let's see what else. Unlock all three Mantis cruisers. Okay, well, we have none, because we have not played this yet. Nice. Uh, rock Homeworlds or defeat with any Lost Sun Cruiser. That's interesting. It's like ahead of it. So you can unlock either way. Okay, for sure. Do have this thing. Don't Didn't get the Type C. Recruit Vortigan using the Cultist Cruiser Type A or, to unlock or unlock the Type Bs of the Rock. Okay, all of them. All right, that's going to take a while. We have Hector, yes. I really want the regular slug ship, but we have not found the Kleptocracy secret construction platform. The Guild Cruiser looks cool as well. All of the uh, Geniocracy ships we don't have. The Orchid one we still don't have. Temporary, oh, this is just, they're going to change this, I see. All of the Thelanius, we don't have any of this. Well, I don't even know what's happening back here. We got this, looks like the Kestrel. This, I think, is like the... God. <laughs> That's all. I'm not even going to bother reading that. Okay. So I think we should finish off this page. But I think first I'd rather do a Zoltan run. Try to unlock the Dustbringer. As well as the Type Bs and Cs, hopefully, of the regular Zoltan. Seems like it'd be pretty cool. And I actually love the Zoltan ships. In the base game, at least. Uh, and this game is probably similar. We got the Halberd Beam. My favorite weapon in the base game. Energy, conservative. Nice. Okay. It's actually pretty dang good. Zoltan shield, as if I would sell this, right? <laughs> and then three Zoltan. I'm pretty sure this is... Is this Zoltan C layout from the base game? Or... Because Zoltan B... Yeah, I don't know. This is one of the Zoltan layouts. Maybe it's the base one. I don't know. I don't remember. Let's just run with the uh, Adjudicator here. And try to unlock the... What are they called? Dustbringers. Yeah. We'll, we'll give that a shot. Zoltan shield. Always love to see it. And then I think next, I mean, you guys, I, I do want to play, where is it? Uh, not here. I do want to play this ship as well, but it seems very challenging. So we'll, we'll get to it eventually. You can only have six crew, which is pretty ugly. So let's just get going here on normal. All right. Proceed with our mission. What do we take? So we're, we're pretty strong off the bat, I think. Another weapon don't really need. Although it could be good, I guess, for more shield taking down. I'm sure we'll find something. I'm going to take another crew member here because that gives us power right off the bat so we don't have Solane in our piloting. And then we'll do a salvage mission. Uh, we'll try it. <laughs> okay, that went pretty well. Well, I'll definitely get the mine launcher for three damage. Who freaking cares? So Vivamord is our new pilot for now. And then you can move to shields. And there we go. We've already gained one free power, which is amazing. Nep this mine launcher. We'll try to delay the fleet with if possible. Beautiful, look at this, bro. We have so much power. So another empty beacon, and we'll probably delay the fleet, depending on what we get. All right, and we're off. 
We will offer our assistance. And we have a Zoltan, so we can overcharge their systems. They get... It's a pirate. That's not so bad. So, yeah, dude. Having a Zoltan shield is so powerful. I love it. Start firing this conservative energy. It does do hull damage, but I don't think it does hull damage if it just hits the shield. It has to hit their hull to actually do the damage, which would make sense, but, you know. Okay, we'll do this. Look at the, t the timing on these weapons. is impeccable already. Oh, my God. Get them out of here. Nice. Beam speed, yeah. Just huge. Absolutely huge. So we got supplies already. I kind of just jumped right away, but we got two supplies, and we should be able to head up to the merchant. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine. Yeah, we'll hit all of these, and then the merchant. I want to get as much secondary resources to sell as possible. You immediately pick up a distress signal, a small shuttle. We'll see if we can assist them. Run by its, his family, and he pleads that you rescue them. He uploads the coordinates. Okay, we got a quest. We should be able to hit that. That'll be nice. One, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, not if we go up to the merchant. So we're just going to skip this jump. We're going to one, two, three, six, seven, eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we'll skip this jump. Got to maximize our jumping effectiveness early on here. So we got 10 scrap, and there's a bunch of rebels here. We're going to attack them, of course. They have the worst weapon. This is the worst ship I've ever seen in FTL. I mean, that's not entirely true, but in multiverse, for sure, this is definitely one of the weaker ones. Should probably be able to one-shot them like this. We definitely will if we can... Uh... Yep. See you guys. Nice try. No, goodbye. God, the halber beam. It's so nice starting out with it. I mean, I would say the Zoltan A is the best ship in base FTL, so obviously multiverse might change things around a little bit. And it definitely does. There's definitely way better ships than this, but still, feels good. Okay, let's uh, definitely delay the... Uh... Well, so here's the thing, right? I lay a trap. It's going to take how many mines? Uh, we do have the Recycler Mine Launcher, I guess. Oh, wait, this is the Nephthys. I didn't even make the connection. This is the free launching one. That's pretty good then, actually. Yeah, we'll, we'll use this for four. That's fine. I didn't even realize this is the same one that doesn't take uh, missiles that we had literally in the last episode. Wow. Well, we'll probably use that then. Nice. He's back. He was he was ready for action. All right. What have we got? Buy an engine upgrade for three fuel. It's this guy again. Uh, I actually will do that because we have some power sitting around in our med bay. That is not necessary. Mantis store. I really want to go to the merchant. Just don't have that much money. But he's or not. What? Well, maybe, maybe we go one and then two, three, four, five, six. Forget the store. Seven, eight. Okay, we'll do that. I want to see if we can get a little bit more stuff. Oh, good heavens. We turn the... Oh, yeah, it's this guy. I think we just blow him up. I don't really care about notoriety yet. The day they change notoriety to matter is the day that I begin fearing for my life in FTL. Multiverse. So, we should be able to take him out pretty quickly here. Assuming this conservative energy weapon does its job. It did... See you guys. Goodbye. Nice. Two more missiles. All right. Down to the merchant we go. He gives us one drone part. Well, we don't have a whole lot to sell, but I guess we'll sell our missiles here. Um, yeah, it's really all we can sell. Or fuel, but I would like to not do that. So there we go. All right. What have you got to sell? Oh, my God. There's a lot of stuff here. So burst three, is it better than the base game? I haven't used it yet. Three power. Oh, it takes. Doesn't it normally take four power? Pretty sure. Maybe not. Maybe I'm miss. Uh, man, there's too many weapons. Eighteen seconds. Okay, it's pretty expensive though. Heavy Mark three is pretty savage. Oh, this thing is like this thing's amazing. This is pretty much a burst laser Mark two. Just. Charges slightly longer. Pierce laser mark two. Enough projectiles to get through four layers of shields. My god. It shoots four char uh, shots. Pierces one layer of shields, but therefore, yeah, so it can... Just this can get one laser through on a four layers of shields. It's not bad, not bad. 17. I kind of want to use this just because I've never used it before. You got a lot of money. Maybe I should just... Like, this is probably the smarter play. 
But I mean, this is so cool looking. Should we do it just for the fun? We got the Zoltan shield. We'll be powerful. Yeah, whatever, dude. At this point, we're just experimenting in FTL multiverse. We're having a good time. So obviously, it's not going to be take ages to get this online. But I think that'll be pretty cool to use. All right, let's continue. Thanks, Sylvan. We'll kill you one day. Perfect. Love to see a good fight. Again, they're they're trash. They are actual just garbage. So whatever. Guess I could do this. They're dead anyways. But you know, might as well. Oh, it missed. Okay, that's fine. We can still if we do this. I think it'll still kill them if we take their shields out. Yeah, they're dead. Nice. This is what I like to call steamrolling. And it's sector one. <laughs> nice. Okay. Picked up a refugee ship drifting. Let's hail them. Okay. They were not having it. They got boarding, but they can't use that yet, which is okay. We'll just do this to kill them. Two, four, six. It'll. We don't even need the energy weapon here. Hallbird will just do the job. Simply too powerful of a weapon. See you guys. Six fuel is quite a bit. Don't really need it though. Twelve is the, my uh, benchmark I like to have. We're at or around that. It should be fine. Distress store, huh? I'd rather go to the quest, so you're going to have to stay distressed, I suppose. Yeah. It's all good. The other thing about the Zoltan shield right off the bat is that I I'm going to get level two regular shields, but I don't need it quite as badly. Oh, it's this guy. Yeah, I'll, I'll fight you so you can join. Do this uh, again. We don't need it quite as badly because we tank five hits easily, which is like just... That's enough time for the halberd beam and this to combine. The energy gun to combine and take ships out. All right. Thank you, Starger. I love an FTL when you do that and the beam goes across. It just magically stops doing damage. It's kind of fun. Okay, so Free Mantis is pretty good. We also have level 2 doors. Completely forgot that it, that is a thing here. Down to the quest. Lots of money. Lots of stuff. We will rescue the space dock for sure. Dude, we are getting insanely lucky with these ships. I mean, if they take down our Zoltan shield, we're going to be a little bit worse off, but like, we're totally fine here. Alright, now Zoltan Shield's down, but this is when Halberd just does the rest for us. Drones are our biggest enemy right now. And look at that, they took us back to max, and they give us a store. Really wish I had saved up for cloaking, but that's okay. Could get mind control. I think I'd rather get some upgrades right now. I would like fuel, but we're, we're fine. I'm not going to sell any of this yet. Having the Nephthys for fleet delays is good. Plus, getting it online is actually going to be pretty helpful. In fact, I'll probably get it online in a second here. Yeah, let's uh, let's do this. And then... Probably do that, I guess. Well, we don't need it online yet. We'll have our Zoltan shield to tank some hits until we actually need our level 2 shields, so that's fine. Alright. Uh, just do this. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> We're okay. Gonna have to go for a maximum damage here instead of hitting their shields. Okay. Nice. That's fine. Well, again, a decent amount of fuel. But I'm still feeling alright. Yeah, so I think we get Nephthys online once we get a little bit more uh, liquidity here. And then that's just always, as we saw last run, is just great constant damage on ships. Missiles, first missile weapon we've seen. Also, first level 2 shields. But that's okay. Because if we do this... Yeah. Da, 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 da. Nice. Okay, Halberd Beam should do some good damage here. Okay, Missile Launcher is down. That's really all I cared about. Dun, 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 dun. We don't even need our second layer shields if this is all they got online. Not having the mine artillery is a bummer. Nice. Halberd beam got in just in time. But we'll we'll be fine with it. Oh my. <laughs> How am I supposed to hold all these halberd beams? Damn, what if we went double halberd beam? Like we got some crazy, like I don't even know. 
like two flax, two halberds. <laughs> okay, we don't need to delay the fleet. We already did our salvage mission. Could get the recycler tech, don't really care. I don't know what I really care about here at all. Could do an internal upgrade. We don't have any money, or that much money at, at least. So I guess we'll do nothing. That's fine. Let's go to the next sector here. Would like to not go to Lanius areas, if possible. It's also not a unique sector, so nobody cares either way. All right, we have some NG Separatists. We'll just quickly do this right off the bat. Easy money. All right. 50 scrap. Exactly. We'll save up a little bit. Let's get a little bit more. Quick scans. Oh, is this Murderbot? Let's try to communicate. Okay, I think this is the Murderbot ship, which is awesome. Because I really like that. Uh, go here. And then go here. Dun, da, 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 da. Nice miss. Hell yeah. See, the nice miss, it goes both ways. Sometimes it's when I'm salty, sometimes it's when I'm happy. It's a catch-all phrase for all FTL veterans. Nice miss. There it is, Murderbot. Hell yeah. So we only have room for one more augment, but I'm okay with that because I like what we have. So how much is it going to cost? 45 Uh, we can, we can hold off. I don't see us needing anything just yet. I'm just going to save up, see if we can find something crazy. You never know. All right, MV ship. We're not going to give them our damn flight plans. They have cloaking, they have a crazy kernel, and they have the adaptive laser. Okay. So we're going to need our shields pretty soon here. But we'll be fine for now. Pew, pew. Should be able to tank uh, a few of these. That's, that's fine. Alright, I'm now going to probably pivot this. I think I'll go something like here. Actually, let's do this instead. Yeah, yeah, look at that. Please don't cloak, please don't cloak, please don't cloak. Nice. Alright, they're barely alive. Actually, energy... Oh, never mind, they got their shields back. Ooh, that did hurt. I mean, you're not... You're not that good at repairing, but you can at least help, I guess. We're going to take one more kernel, I think. Which is a bummer. Nope, Halber Beam came through. Hell yeah. Alright, we took a little bit of damage. It's fine. Giles, you come heal. You come help. Get those repair skills up. Ninety-nine scrap, huh? It's probably time we make some upgrades, unless there's a store. I'm a fiend for stores. Okay, let everyone get back to where they're meant to be. There we go. And then do this. There is a store. It's a pirate store. Okay. Well, we have a second halberd beam, which as fun as it would be to do double halberd beam type thing, I don't know if that's really that viable. At least, especially not now. Holding onto it for that long is probably not the best. We could attack them, I guess. Let's just hail them. Ooh, I do kind of need fuel. Is that a good deal? How much is fuel normally? Nah, whatever. Oh, what? Oh, I, <laughs> I misplayed that. I thought... Uh, okay, I don't even... Just whatever. Let's get a power. And then let's get one more of these... So we can now do this and this. Hell yeah. Okay. I'm liking that. Come this way. We One, two, three, four. We can hit the distress. Really wanted to buy some fuel. It's okay. Should be able to find some out in the world. This is not... Okay, it's drone targeting. Never mind. Don't care. So we'll just start auto-firing. I guess like this. This is mostly for damage. We have a ton of other weapons that can do great. System and hull damage. Actually, we should... Oh, it already fired. Well, it's fine. This, Yeah, I was going to say the, the mines will take them out. Oh, baby. Nice some fuel. Another distress. Okay. I really want to get this Pierce 2 online. I've never used it. Uh, this is risky, but I'm going to do it because I'm a madman. I am an absolute madman. <laughs> okay. 
Would you like to... Uh, you are in luck. I'm in possession of expensive data suite. Yes. Most of it's random junk. Recipe for fish-shaped ethyl benzene cake and an article on the importance of honesty. At last, you see the map downloading. Jumps away. What, are we going to get a virus? No? He's good. We just got a map. Okay. So there's the link. I want to hit the store, so I think we'll skip the distress. We'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. We'll just hit all this stuff down here. Booby trap the cash. We will definitely be doing that. Okay. Well, that's good. Still a little bit low on fuel, since we have actually zero. So if these guys surrender with fuel, we're going to have to... Because you can't... Yeah, you can't do that here. Let's fight. Okay. You come here. You come here. Get this halberd ready like so. Whoa, 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 stop. Stop. I'm pressing all the wrong keys. Okay. Guess we can do this. Got that reactor upgrade. Nope, they're not giving fuel, so we're just going to have to hope for the best here, I guess. Hopefully they give us some when they blow up. There we go, energy cannon. Come on, baby. Come on, fuel. God damn it. <laughs> we did delay the fleet, so it's not that bad, but... Okay, they're not here to help. That's fine. Start this going here. This going here, and then... Do that. Surely they won't be able to get away in time. I mean, technically, this is just a free jump, sort of, right? It's not all bad. Okay, that's not great. Still gonna fire the halberd because I cannot let them get away. So. Hopefully, you guys can't hear that car alarm. You probably can. But, oh well. Alright, they're in trouble now. Nice. Absolute classic living in a big city. What's to be expected? Yeah, they're not going anywhere. Nephthys is gonna take that. They're charging again. No way. Come on, Albert. There we go. Okay. Not so bad. Let me close this damn window. We can hope that worked. Okay. Two fuel. That's not a lot, but that will be enough, well, to probably get us to the store. Uh, one, two. I guess we'll go to the link first. Let's see what we got. So, uh, this is something you do here is part of the main, like, the true quest ending or something, right? Oh, well, <laughs> here we go. Okay, we're definitely going to try to do this. So, let me read this again. Are the ships composed of gigantic cubicle segments are larger than any vessel you've ever seen, but they're being completely decimated? Strangely designed, but non-cubicle, automaton rests silently by the wreckage. You aren't sure if moving closer will awaken it. We will destroy the ship first. I think. Is it using all of its systems? Let's hope it stays that way. Okay, so this could be pretty dicey for sure. We're just going to fire everything we have. Oh, they have cloaking, huh? Interesting. Do this, I guess. I'm pretty sure they, like, power up more. Look at all this stuff in the background. Very, very sweet. Honestly, we should really go... They don't even... Yeah, do this instead. Uh, yeah, okay, sure. Here comes their mine, or something. It moves insanely slowly, I remember this. Okay, Zoltan Shield, thank you. Uh, do I Halberd? I think I do. And then we'll pivot, like, this, maybe? I don't know. Just do some damage. Took their cloaking out, which is good. We still have one Zoltan Shield, which will absorb a hit from this thing, which is good. Okay, they resisted it, but we did. Okay. Your translator struggles, turning out nonsense like, yeah, yeah, Some kind of bizarre combat augment. Okay, so now they're, they're pogging up big time. It's this crazy looking thing, which is bad. And our shields are hacked. Halberd might be able to do the job if uh, it hits everything non-resisted. Yes, okay. Well, <laughs> that went pretty well. Large helping to scrap. You scout the remain. It appears most of the whole material is unrecognized, and it's too strong to be stripped for scrap. However, made these ships has been highly advanced or from a completely different galaxy. Inside one of the larger cruisers, you're surprised to find what appears to be a robot of some sorts, entirely cubicle in craft. It's been partially dissolved, and strange-looking Lanius corpses are scattered around. You bring back the robot to the ship out of curiosity, but without any obvious way to activate it, it'll have to remain in the back corners of the storage bay for now. Along with it, you find some strange cords that you mark on your map. Perfect. To the next sector. Okay. Well, you know what we're doing in the next video. 
Uh, I will look up exactly what has to be done because we're freaking doing that quest, okay? We're making it happen. Um, and I'm going to make everything I can, do everything I can to, to make that happen. So I will look up what needs to be done in between episodes. Okay. So these guys require supplies. That, yeah, it's absurd. You guys are on some, some BS for that. A burst laser mark two. Not bad. In fact, let's actually do that. They only have 8 HP, so this will kill them if we can take their shields down. Boom. There you go. We're pretty powerful, which is amazing. Nice. 12 scrap. Go to this store. Well, actually, one, two. We can go here first. Might as well. We got enough fuel now. Do -do -do -do. Targeting jammer for absolute free. That's pretty good. Um, it does mean we're maxed out on augments, but it could be okay, I think. Hunker down. Yeah, we'll, we'll approach the corpse. Shut down? No, we just wish to shop here, bro. Slave, I don't want Tom Hanks, aka Tom Banks. Just shop. Uh, so they got cloaking, 170. Pike, Glaive, uh, Falcon. Falcon. Some dronage. Tell you what, 170 is a mighty nice price tag. Something is amazing. Okay, so here's the reality of the situation. Halberd beam, you're getting yoinked. We don't quite have enough. If we sell targeting jammer, we will have enough for cloaking. And I think that's going to be worth it. I like targeting jammer a lot, but I think getting cloaking is a little bit more helpful. So let's just get that right off the bat here. And we got a big quest line ahead of us, I already know, so that's going to be super helpful. Plus, we already have the power to make it happen, so I'm okay with that. And then, I'll buy as much fuel as I can, I guess, and we'll exit. Okay. We will explore. We will attempt to contact the drone. Nice. They scan us and give us stuff. All right, next sector. Mantis Quarter or unregistered nebula. Let's definitely go to the Mantis Quarter. I think with the Zoltan Shield, we have a bit of defense against them, which is nice. So yeah, hope you guys are excited for the next episode. That was a good start. We got the, the ancient quest line again. It's been a while, but we're back. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. See ya.